You're cool. Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome to Grammy's Nature Nugget. So glad you could be here today. Today, will you come up and sit on Grammy's quilt? Oh, please. Christian, come over here right in front. Claire, come here. Great. Today, we're going to talk about one of the most beautiful, beautiful, brightly colored birds in all of the planet. It lives up to 80 years. It can live that long. And it's an in very intelligent. I know you know this one, Christian. Yeah. Oh, Claire, you guessed it. It's right, parrot. They are absolutely gorgeous birds. They're so colorful. And they can live up to as long as 80 years. That's a tremendous commitment on an owner. And they're very intelligent birds. They have over 370 species of bat birds. And in their family are parakeets, macaws, cockatiels, cockatoos, and lovebirds. So one of their distinguishing uh, features is that they sleep standing on one foot. There was a parakeet and his name was Puck and he knew over 1700 words he could speak. So that was amazing and that went down in the Guinness Book of Records. There is, they live in tropical or subtropical areas and they all have a very curved beak. They are zygodactical and that means they have four toes, two go forward and two go back and that is really helps with balance. They are, um, I've got a coloring picture, it says God made the parrots and you can see his very curved beak you can color that so bright, the brighter, the better colors. And you can see that those two um, paws or claws go forward and two are on the other side. So it says God made the parrots. Parrots can be three and a half to 40 inches long and they can mimic human speech. In the wild, hey Cooper, they have groups called, they're part of flocks, and there can be up to 20 to 30 in a flock. They're monogamous, which means they have one mate for life, and that mate works together with the female to raise the young. They have such colorful plumage or feathers. They're just beautiful. They are omniferous, which means they eat both meat and vegetation. And they love nuts and seeds are their favorite, but they eat buds and flowers and um, sometimes insects. So they are diverse in their diet. I'm gonna show you a video clip now of a bird called Alex, and he is an African gray parrot and was probably one of the most intelligent birds of the parrot family. And he was used in research to learn all kinds of things. So we're going to roll that video right now. Look, what color bigger? What color bigger? Green. Green. Oh, you're a good boy. Okay, Alex, look. Well, look what I got for you. Hey, look. Look at all these neat toys. Look. Hey, look, can you tell me? On the tray, how many green block? Green block. Good parrot. Two green block. Two. Good parrot. So Alex is an extremely bright and wonderful bird and he could count up to six and he could answer questions, he could recognize colors 
and he had 30, he could, rec he could recognize 35 different objects. So parrots are dinernal, which means they are, they sleep during the day and are active at night. Um, they make screeching loud noises and they have a lot of body language which they communicate to each other. They, there is a real commitment that goes into owning a parrot because they live so long. And you would have to make sure they were well taken care of if something happened and you were, they were left without an owner. Um, these birds have to be well trained because if they're not, they have been known to bite and they can bite very hard. So um, you would really want to make sure if you got a parrot that you um, got it when you were young and worked with it and spent a lot of time with it and but parrots are just such beautiful animals you can see them at a pet store probably but you want to be careful around the cage not to stick your fingers in there i'm so glad you came to look at today's nature nugget about the parrot and i i just want to pray with you right now. Father, thank you so much for these beautiful animals, the parrot, for all how bright they are and how beautifully colored they are. I pray, God, that you will bless each child with this information, and thank you for the parrots that you've placed in our world for us to enjoy. In Jesus' name, Amen.